Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying two HERS products that we have never tried. Mm -hmm. So these have, may have been out there for a while. I don't remember actually seeing these anywhere. I'm sure they've been out for it, but I don't remember. Probably, I'm sure in the area where HERS is popular, which yeah. is uh, Pennsylvania, they're probably out all the time, but yeah, we don't see them a lot here. here. So we have the pumpkin spice flavored snack balls. And I have the party mix, which is all kinds of stuff. These were both found at Rural King, and the snack balls were a dollar seventy nine, and <laughs> Kevin's party mix was four ninety nine. Now they also had a container the same size of cheese balls. Yeah, yeah, just cheese balls. They oh, had so. cheese balls. They also had at Rural King um, the snack balls. They had the hot cocoa and they had peppermint. peppermint. But we've already reviewed both of those. Yep. So. Uh, type in Tammy Dunn Hers on YouTube you'll and, and you'll see a bunch of Hers products come up. So this is the one that we had not tried. The um, crunchy and sweet pumpkin spice flavored snack balls. They're crunchy corn snacks. They're gluten free. It says spice up your snacking. Hers pumpkin spice flavored snack balls are a unique way to satisfy your pumpkin spice cravings for the fall season. This popular combination features sweet pumpkin flavor and just the right amount of spices all wrapped up in fun to eat snack balls. It's time to enjoy the season with just a little more spice. What is funny about them saying that, that that's for fall and everything, is the display boxes that they had, you could tell that they got shipped with pumpkin spice, peppermint, and hot cocoa. All the same so way. yeah, so in those boxes you got like a mixture of these. So even though they're saying fall, they're also putting the winter flavors in there too. We didn't have these around at fall. So um, 39 pieces, 28 grams is 150 calories. And you're right. Um, you know, I'm uh, I'm thinking it's the most wonderful time of the year, and um, you're thinking more winter. I'm thinking winter. Well, especially when you see peppermint. Gosh, that smells good. That smells like mm -hmm. pumpkin spice. I mean, strong. It's very strong, though. I wonder if it's gonna be too. It strong. is strong. That, but you can't. If you were to just look at these, you'd be like, oh, they, those don't have anything on. I think that's weird how they put that cheese ball. The, without the cheese mm -hmm. um, and put all kinds of seasonings on it and sell them off. I think it's weird. Those are addictive because of They're the good. texture. The texture and the way that it collapses. Mm, like a pack of peanuts. Yeah, makes you just, you want to keep grabbing more. You know, but I don't like necessarily the underlying flavor of the ball. You don't like so, the pumpkin spice? I don't mind the pumpkin spice, but the pumpkin spice only lasts for like a brief burst of flavor and then it's gone. Yeah, I agree. All right, so there it tastes really good and then it's gone and then all you're left with is the, the, the ball itself, mm -hmm. which really doesn't have much flavor at all. So you're sitting there eating some crunchy that's kind of, ugh, you know. Right. The smell was stronger than the flavor. Yeah. I do like the flavor while you have it. Though. I do too. I wish that it was stronger. Yeah. I wish that they had had more powder in, or on Or infused them. it in it somehow. Yeah, I really do. I wish yeah. they had had more powder on these. Because like, you, and, that, I, and some people would probably complain. Oh, I got powder all over my hands. If they had pow a powder co coating. But at least there would be more of that good pumpkin spice flavor because it is really nice when it's there. Um, but I agree, it's it's a lighter, it's much lighter than what it smells. Yeah, yeah I wish it was. I wish it hung around a little bit more. So this um, party mix has three things in it. Oh, really? It has corn chips, fried cheese curls, and nacho cheese flavored tortilla chips. It looks like it also has just regular plain tortilla chips then. Well, those are the things that list on the back. I'm looking at, I'm seeing pretzels. It did list yeah. pre pretzels. Yeah, pretzels are in there. They probably um, didn't, I don't know. But it doesn't, on the ingredients, it highlights, uh, it says corn chips and it gives all the ingredients for the corn chips. And then it says fried cheese curls. It gives all the ingredients for those. Nacho cheese flavored tortilla chips. It gives the ingredients for the, oh wait, Pretzels. It does have pretzels at the very, very bottom. bottom. Yeah. At the very, very bottom. So there's four things. So there's four things in here. Forgive me. I did not see the pretzels. Pretzels probably just has flour and salt. <laughs> okay. 
pretzels are the only thing that kind of scary is they're dark. You want to try a pretzel first? Sure. They put a little scald on them. I think they're, they're they're good and crunchy. They have mm -hmm. a good flavor to them. They have a scorched flavor. Mm-hmm. It's not necessarily a bad thing. It's different. I think it's good because it's different. Because um, typically you get those um, pretzels that are just cooked to perfection, which are really good. But you know what? These have, and this is going to sound like I'm being negative, but I'm really not. They have, you're left with a little burnt taste in your mm -hmm. mouth. You are. But I like it. I really do like well, that. Okay, so what do you want to try next? Uh, I don't care. Just, just a tortilla. So. These look like one of those giant Fritos. Mm -hmm. But it's a corn chip, so. Mm. And that's just a... Good salty corn chip. Yeah. That's good. Mm-hmm. That's very good. That would be good with uh, uh, cheese sauce or... Um, even salsa. Yeah. Try one of the Cheeto looking things. A cheese curl. Uh, those are okay. I don't care for that cheese. They're, they're, they're okay. The cheese that they used on the cheese curl. I agree. It's not as good as like a Cheeto, but. I personally do not like the You cheese. would skip those. I would skip the curls. Honestly, I would, out of the match, I'd skip those two. Mm -hmm. Okay, now the, these are darker. Those are like the Doritos. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. No, spice them. Yeah, that's like a, would you call that a Chipotle flavor? It tastes like a, it tastes like a chili, oh, a chili good. cheese Frito is what it tastes like. That is so good. Now, what's the difference between this? I one? think it has Chipotle. It might be. See, these are really dark red and square, but look, I have a triangle one. Oh, those look like Doritos. Yeah. Well, they only highlight a couple. Well, it's the same I flavor. really. Oh, it's the same flavor. Mm -hmm. That's my favorite thing in there. Oh, mine too. It's very, mm -hmm. very good. It's got some spice to it too. A little bit of a tingle in the back of your throat. They could sell just those. I wonder they if they do. do. You think they do? Uh, I've never so. seen them if they do. I don't know. Let us know. Because they have like a Chipotle for me. Mm -hmm. they're, they're smoky. They're very okay. smoky, spicy. They're really good. Like my, my tongue is tingling, mm -hmm. but it's in a good way. Yeah, I agree. It has a lot of flavor, but it, it still has the heat. Um, definitely that's my favorite thing in there. Yeah. I liked everything except for those, um, the cheese, the cheese, cheese curls. curls. Yeah. And honestly, I don't think you get a lot of those in there anyway. I would, so, I would eat those. Mm -mm. If you bumped dump them in a big bowl and, and was, I would pick those out. I still <laughs> I would, think. I would not eat those. No, it, it, the cheese it just, it wasn't a good cheese. No, it doesn't. But I still think for $4.99, five bucks for this, if you're having a party and you have a great big bowl, um, out, you could no. dump the whole thing out and everybody could get some. And I think they would be very happy. Mm -hmm. This is a, a cheap uh, a way to feed people at a party. You could get a couple of these if you wanted. Um, but yeah, this is really good. I like this a like lot. It. So yeah, please let us know. Do they sell these little corn chips? Do they sell them in separate bags? Because we just don't see them around here. We don't get a... Oh, we get some hers. During the summer, usually. Yeah, but we don't, like, get a full range. And, like, and these aren't common, like we said. Um, so I was glad to find these. Mm -hmm. But I'm, I'm glad, I'm kind of glad we didn't buy those cheese puffs. Because I had wondered, should yeah. we get those? They're not as round as, like, the planters. They're not they were, these. They're about the same. They're the same they, they, yeah, they, yeah. yeah, they, they, they're yeah. the same balls. Yeah, they, I, okay, I forgot we had those laying here. They, <laughs> yeah, they're not as big and round as the planters. I think they're small. I think these are smaller than the planters. Yeah. Um, but I'm glad we didn't get them because I have a feeling those would be the exact same cheese as those cheese, cheese girls. Yeah, and I don't really care for the cheese either. I mean, it's yeah. okay. I, I could eat them. But, I don't, and I don't like it But the all. other ones in there are so much better. Yes. That I would just believe those. And even the pretzel with that, that little burnt so. flavor, <laughs> I like it. I think it's yeah. good. I can definitely see that. 
dipped in some uh, some cheese dip. Yeah. Like that Velveeta Mexican, uh, you can get that Velveeta Mexican yeah. log and melt it. That would be awesome with these uh, pretzels. Really good. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.